So, lots of you are probably curious on how this video actually works and what it's supposed to show. In this video, I'm going to go a little more in depth on what it's supposed to do and how it works. So, if you look at the stat called Messages in Reascend Queue, you'll notice that it doesn't really move much as I stand still. This is because this stat effectively records your movement and camera usage during gameplay. What this means is that the value will fluctuate based on how much you're moving and using your camera during obby gameplay. So when I play, it should look something like this. Now, if you look at the messages in Reascend Q stat, you'll notice that it fluctuates while I move. This is how it should look, and this is what the video is supposed to show. On higher FPS, the fluctuation point will be much higher. On 60 FPS, this value can fluctuate anywhere from 0 to 2, all the way up to 0 to 8 when playing an obby. Now, if you look in the bottom right corner, you'll see that I am actually recording a replay. This is to show you what would happen if I used a replay instead of actually played the obby. I will do a side-by-side -side comparison of me playing the obby and using the replay. Now, if you look at the right screen, you'll notice that the messages in recent Q stat is not fluctuating as it normally would, like you see on the left. This is because it's a replay, and that means it is not actually me doing the movements, but a replay doing the movements. This means I am not actually doing any raw inputs, nor moving my camera, and it acts as if I'm idle. All of that is an example of what's shown in this video. If I was using a replay, all my videos would look more like the replay instead of me actually playing the obby. If you go back and watch my videos, you notice that the value fluctuates, unlike me using the replay as seen earlier in the video. I hope that clears everything up and explains what this video shows. Thank you, and stay tuned.